everybody, this is Mari and I'm in Las Vegas at the 2017 Mr. Olympia Fitness Expo. We're going to check out what's new in the fitness world and the bodybuilding world. Come follow me! booth with Evan. How are you doing today? Uh, good. Good to see you. I was just wondering with your workout regimen, I want to look like that, oh but not too muscular because I'm a female, obviously, but tell me what you do. Right. Well, um, my philosophy happens to align very well with the animal brand philosophy, and that's we stick to the basics. We, we stick to what works. We stick to what's time tested. So for me, um, you know, whether it's in my training, my nutrition, I stick to, you know, the fundamentals. What's, you know, there's really no, uh, no magic, no no fluff, uh, no shortcuts. So with that being said, do you eat healthy obviously too, right? Yeah, I mean obviously a, a large part of what we do has to be supported by our nutrition, um, you know, whether it's the food and of course supplements. Okay. So what kind of supplements do you like to take? Um, you know, for me, again, whether it's training or nutrition, we're always fundamentals first. So, you know, uh, Animal Pack is a great multivitamin, multi-mineral product. Uh, that's a, a staple in my my program year-round. Uh, Animal Omega, which is an, uh, an EFA supplement. Uh, amino acids, of course, you know, uh, some different uh, carbohydrate powders, you know, things like that that can, uh, you know, augment my training. You know, the simple stuff, creatine, glutamine, etc. Whether it's me or anyone else at Animal will always tell you guys, food first, you know, solid nutrition first. Uh, the supplements, they fall in around that. And they're just that, supplements. Sounds good. Well, thank you very much for your time. I'm at the Nutrex booth with Anton. How are you doing today? Hi, I'm good. How are you? I'm so happy to meet you. Look at you. You're so handsome. Oh yes, you are tan. What do you do to get that tan? I want that tan. Yeah, you actually use pro tan. So uh, for the competition tan, we use pro tan. It's a couple of layers, and clearly we got to get really, really dark because the stage lights are so bright. So uh, and then we got to put the oil on. So it's a bit of a hassle showering it off, but. Yeah. But it's all worth it in the end. So tell me about your fitness workout routine. Uh, my training routine. I uh, getting ready for a contest. I usually train. Uh, I, I have very little days off. Uh, it could be like seven days a week. Sometimes I'll take one day off, okay. um, and uh, it wears you down a little bit. But it's again, it's worth it in the end. Uh, I train single muscle group a day, um, and uh, I do cardio in the morning and weight training at night. And what supplements do you take to help keep up the energy? Uh, so I take Lipo Six. Uh, I take uh, Outlift and Hemorrhage, which is my favorite pre-workout. You could definitely feel it. Uh, and Nyox. If, uh, if you guys and girls are looking for a crazy, crazy pump, check out Nyox. It's uh, one of my favorite products. Do you have any specific recommendations for female bodybuilders that don't want to get too buff but want to get fit? Yeah, uh, Nutrix makes a really good product called uh, L-Carnitine Liquid. So it's liquid carnitine. You take it at night. It's, uh, it, it sort of acts as a fat burner. Uh, or you could take, uh, they make a, a formula of Lipo 6 specifically for women. I'm at Optimum Nutrition with the one and only Sean Stafford. How are you doing today? You know what? Considering it's the second day of what has been an incredibly busy Olympia, I'm actually feeling good. My voice is a little bit hoarse, it's a little bit sketchy, but full of energy. We're on the finishing straight, not long to go. I've been following you on Instagram a little bit. Thank you. <laughs> You've been traveling a lot, right? How do you put in fitness and nutrition and travel and everything with your boy? I say uh, traveling and staying in shape is not that easy, but it's one of those things where if you're in shape and you train when you get in, you watch what you eat whenever you get to a new country, it definitely makes the traveling side of things easier because you feel better, you have more energy, you sleep well. So it's kind of like the fitness helps with my traveling and then, you know, I'm actually traveling for the fitness stuff. So I get to, I'm blessed 
that I get to travel around the world and meet loads of new people from all different countries, all different walks of life. It's an amazing job, so no complaints. So do you have cheat days? I really want to know. I have cheat weekends. Ooh, yeah. weekends. Okay, so tell me about it. For me, a cheat day isn't necessarily going and eating stuff that is bad for you. For me, it's just about not having to be controlled with what I eat. So I could go and, you know, have a nice healthy breakfast, but I'm not thinking about calories. I could go and have a, a nice coffee or, you know, a nice, a nice Sunday roast, which for a lot of people that is eating healthy. But for me, a cheat day is all about not having to watch what you eat, not having to think about counting calories or looking at macros. It's just about letting yourself enjoy your food and enjoy a little bit of time off. Well, I see these little protein cake bites here. They look like those would be great non-cheating cheat day items. What do you, can you tell me a little bit more about them? I can. So the cake bites are, when we, uh, we, put, we sort of launched these last year, it was Optimum Nutrition's 30th birthday, and we launched a birthday cake. Oh, here it comes. Whoa. <laughs> they threw three, I caught one. Oh, I that is not good, that's not good numbers. But they launched a birthday cake flavored protein bar. It was such a success that they've carried it on and they launched the cake bite. This one here is a chocolate frosted donut. Let's have a look at these. It tells you all the stats on there. Seven grams of protein per bite. There's, uh, how many calories in it? I should know this. 80. Only 80 calories. Wow. So they taste amazing. It's a little bit like eating a bit of a donut. But, right. you're, but you're helping to hit that calorie number, helping to hit those protein numbers. It's a great non-cheat cheat. Obviously you're very famous and everyone knows you, but for those of the, the people that don't know, where can they follow you? So if you guys are on social media and you want to see a little bit more about what I do, you can jump onto my Facebook page at Sean Stafford Fitness, which is, for all those in America, it's S-H-A-U-N, Stafford Fitness. Or if you're on Instagram or Twitter, at Sean Stafford, S-H-A-U-N-S-T-A-F-F-O-R-D. Very interesting pages to follow. Thank you so much for your time, Sean. Take care.